Hi, welcome to my channel, Sewing with Mary Rose. If you're new here, this channel is all about sewing, embroidery, and my Etsy shop. In this video, I'm showing you what I did to create this patch in Merrily from Embrilliance. Here we are getting into the Embrilliance section, and it is a module that can build on each format that you choose to purchase. So I already had a couple of the modules, Stitch Artists and Essentials. I added Merrily on recently and you can see here how easy it is to create a patch. So you'll go into Utility and this is a wrap type of fill around the edges in a marrow type stitch. I'm enlarging it and this is a four by four hoop size. I created this hat for opening day for my son's t-ball game. And here I am saving it in a PES file for my brother PE 800 and you will see how that stitched out. So I'm saving it here and then I am going to create another file in the JEF format for my MB4 needle machine. So after this, you'll see at the end how both of these came out. This is so simple and easy to use. I wanted to show you all of the different fonts that comes with this program. Look at, there are so many of them. Um, tiny itty bitty fonts. I can't wait to use them. I am going to be making some more patches. Since these were my first two patches, I have so many ideas of things that I want to do. And I'm probably going to get started on that today. I want to use these little patches for my son's jackets and coats and things that he might leave around. And here I'm showing you how easy it is to create. You open utilities. This is a rectangle um, pattern around the edge. Here's a circle and it's so easy to remove and add on another patch. They also have different patch um, shapes that you can choose. I'm only showing you the basics here. Right here, I wanted to show you quickly how you can use Project Advisor and it will tell you what kind of needle to use, what kind of uh, fabric is recommended. And I did not use this for my MB4 and you'll see here how that turned out. I have a lot of looping there and it wasn't the best. Over here, this is my PE800. It turned out beautifully. I'm really happy with how it turned out. If you like this video, please hit the like and subscribe. Thanks for watching.